So if you have set up your Galaxy S25 Ultra or Plus and you have installed dual SIM or eSIM, now if you want to set up call forwarding for incoming calls, let's go ahead and see how to activate call forwarding feature. Alright, so the quickest way to get to that is just open up your phone's app, tap on this three dot, from there go to settings, scroll down for supplementary services and enter. In case you're using dual SIM, just select the first SIM to add call forwarding, tap on the call forwarding option. Then first select whether you want to set it up for voice or video calls. You can do both one after another. So I'm going to enter the voice calls. As you can see, there are four situations when you can forward calls. Like you can select always forward to forward all the calls to that number no matter what. In this case, the other three options will be disabled. You can also select to forward calls when you're busy in a current call or when you cannot answer or if you're out of mobile network. So to forward calls, just tap on any of these options, put down your number and simply tap on turn on. And when the situation comes up, for example, I've chosen forward to this number when I'm busy in another call, any incoming call will be forwarded to my selected number. And uh, lastly, anytime you can just come back in here, tap on any of the options that have previously selected. You can either update or change the number and also turn off call forwarding to that number. You can follow this exact process for video calls as well. We should never miss an important call after that. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching.